Hey there, flesh and blood friends. Today's gameplay video was recorded real time at my LGS, Gonga Games, in Portland, Oregon, USA, my source for flesh and blood sealed product. Channel followers can use code COMMANDO10 for 10% off flesh and blood and Star Wars Legion product. Thanks for watching, and remember that our players are real, normal people being recorded live at our events. Please be respectful, show your appreciation with a like, subscribe, and leave a supportive or constructive comment. And remember, as always, go Commando! There we go. Put it right here for camera's reasons, right? Never works. Yeah. You cut mine? Yes, I did. Uh, you rolled nine? Okay. I rolled nine. I rolled ten. You rolled ten. Your choice. I will go... Second. Okay. Let's hope I get that arcane damage. <laughs> Good luck. Have fun. Good luck. Have fun. If you do, then I, I'm in trouble. I mean... I have two options. I kind of like them both. Don't forget the two. Yeah. It's, it's a funny hand because there's one that's like, it's not going to do any damage, but it's funny. It would have been a lot better in my next hand. Uh, so I think we'll set, I think we'll, yeah, we'll go for the safer bet. So we'll Sonata saying X is three, pitching six, creating three rune chance. Arsenaling this and passing to you. Okay. Turn to run. So it is a fruit. So it is a fruit. So I'll draw the appropriation. One left. Then one. You don't see three. Do a black. Uh, we'll block three, take five, unless reactions. No reactions. Okie dokie. We're going to play an Endless Winter from Arsenal, pitching Luncheon Press and Buzzsaw. So the thing I could have done in turn one is I could have fused this to give you Frostbites if you blocked it. To start your turn with like three frost bites or something like that, but I'll take the three rune chance popping here instead. Um, and then on hit, uh, if you activate a ability, you create a frost bite. That's just an on hit that's always there. Uh -huh. Other than that, it's, Other than just, that it's just coming in for eight. Just come, just eight. Yeah, yeah. If you have fuse, it's if you block. Whenever you block with something, it creates a frost bite. We've got two floating. Oh, the old pummel float, huh? Ah, uh, that tunic, oh well. Go ahead. Oh, okay. Sure. Yeah. yeah. It's just blitz. I mean, <laughs> it's just an army. I mean, yeah, but also, like, I try to be strict with myself to a certain degree. Potentially 12. <laughs> Okay, wow. Um, 
On six. Okay. No reactions. Uh, take two. Yep. Taking two and on hits at uh, Arsenal that. So if you activate any abilities, it will create a frostbite. Activate any abilities. Oh. Yeah, so like if you did like if you had the counters for tunic, for instance, that would be it. Or if you were to pay for crater fist. Okay. I think that's it, because I don't think you have any on your hero that it would matter for. Mm -hmm. Four. Mm -hmm. Four. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Make me discard with it. Uh, we'll block four with armor. Take a tunic. Uh, we do have one effect. We will do a shakedown for six. The chain ice eternal. Shakedown is if I do an attack reaction, I pick a pitch color, you reveal your hand, and then I banish one of that pitch color if it hits. Blocking six. Okay. Uh, in reactions, we'll quicken some more here too. Yeah, no worries. Uh, we'll get a resource and then we'll pummel on top of it. It's just a block. It's my real Fly life Makes sense. I would have to play this earlier, I think. Now, my curious question is, like, when I sunk and I drew this card, could I have played it? I mean, you, you have a reaction step now. It's not a reaction. Oh, then no. I couldn't have played it. No, no yeah, because it, if it's something you got off the sunk, you block, do the sink, and then, and then we go into the reaction step, um, which... Is it an instant then or something like that? Or um, So I guess, uh, do you have any reactions though? No. Okay, then I'm going to say blue. So I'm going to my whole hand? Yes, and then I pick a blue. Um, and I banish it. Uh, I see what you're saying. It must have been this one. Yeah, yeah you had no opportunity upon using that yeah. to, to yeah. block with it. Yeah. Um... I think we'll just, I'll make you banish the cranial and then you'll discard one off a pummel of your choice. And taking four. That is the right choice. That is my turn passing to you. Two to three. Uh, does it have go again? No, it does not. It's <laughs> zero. So just coming in for five. five. Um, I'm going to say no blocks reactions. Nine. No, no, no. Should I? I 
it's funny, but it's probably not actually worth it. Better just to discard it. Yeah, so I'll take the nine. Okay, discard the northern winds. I, I had, uh, I'm going to pitch it, but I had the Spike Pit Trap, which banishes the top card of your deck if you've done a reaction and then does an amount of damage, but then that was too many cards out of my hand after the discard. Yeah. Um, start. I haven't used that yet. Oh, okay. Yeah. Because you gave right it to me off of the one thing. Right. Uh, we're using it now, because now we're going to have a shakedown with Go again. Oh no, now you are, but then they're going to So did you end up buying around the table? Because last I checked, you thought you didn't have one of the Civic Steps? I had one. I bought one. Oh, you bought one? A long time ago. Uh, okay. Um, I might have enough credit to split one if they have one here. But I don't know if it's going to be necessary now with part of the misfail coming out. There might be the reprints of the things right. I wanted to get. Because yeah. I got one in uh, L.A. using my tickets. Right. Oh, shit down. Same, same as last time, just this one has to go again. So that will pummel, of course. And we'll say blue. So it gets banished. Oh. So the other one did. Yeah, the other one should be. Not that it really matters in our game, but. <laughs> Um, and then yeah, I guess yeah, and you'll discard your pummel. Man, we both got our pummels like at the same time. Yeah. Um, hang on. Before you do that, yeah, it's fine anyway. So, um, so I've got go again. Yeah, I'll make you. I'll, I'll spend the life to then swing flail for one on hit creates a rune chant. Get a rune chant. That is my turn. Yeah, I know. Look at me. I thought I died. Your turn. Alright. Uh, we'll crack Goliath Gauntlet. And we will. Yeah, actually, one of the. Golden Sun, pitching up the ante and alluring inducement, uh, using this as a gold to give it plus three and overpower the one rune chant. So coming in for 12 overpower and one rune chant. <laughs> <laughs> All I got is action card, so. Oh yeah, that's fair. That's, kind of, that's that's what the finisher of this deck is essentially, is to or one of the finishers. So you hold all your pummels and everything right in the. Oh, I, I run rainbow of the pummels, yeah. <laughs> 